What's going on? Diamond Rice here coming at you with another tutorial. This is going to be hopefully trying to fix Modern Warfare 2 Campaign Remastered. Uh, as you can see when I click play, I click launch, no safe mode, error code, out of memory error, you're probably low on disk space. I'm going to show you today how to actually try and potential fixes to this particular bug. Now, one of the suggested potential fixes is to run the game into safe mode with networking. Now, unfortunately, for those who have a Microsoft account and you're on 1909 or 1809, you'll notice that in the login screen of the safe mode is asking for a password. If you have any other particular uh, authentication, either by PIN, your face with Windows Hello, fingerprint, etc., you'll notice that there's a very big and major bug that was not been fixed yet. Uh, as of right now, the only way to do it is to actually go in and get the Windows version 2004, which will be the May update sometime later this month. Now, to get to this easily, you can do this either by waiting that long, or you can go into settings, go into settings, go into update and security, go under the Windows Insider program. You can actually pick slow or some of the other additional ones for ins insider purposes and get access to this version 2004. So now if I go over to home, I go back to system, go to about, you'll notice I'm in version uh, Windows 10 version 2004. Now this version actually does pick fix the bug with the password, the password bug essentially that is happening in 1809 and 1909. Essentially, if you do not have a password, if you don't have a local account, it will not work until you get to this version. It has been patched uh, to enable pin verification. So I use pin verification for getting into the PC normally, and now I'm gonna show you how it does it inside of the safe mode. Now to get into safe mode, the best way to do it is go back to home of the settings application, go to update security, go to recovery, and then go click the advanced startup button. That's the one that we're going to be going into. So I'm going to show you once I click restart. Okay, so now once you get hit the restart button, you get to this option to where it goes to advanced startup. This advanced startup allows you to get to the safe mode. So to go, and once you get to this menu, go to troubleshoot, go to advanced options, and go to startup settings, the one over there, left-hand side in the middle. So it says here, go ahead, restart the change options thing, options for safe mode, driver enforcement, etc. Go ahead and click restart. Okay, once you click restart in the startup settings, you'll notice when you reboot, you have these options for enable debugging, safe mode, safe mode with networking, or enable safe mode with com uh, command prompt. The one you want is safe mode with networking, so press 5. This will allow me to get access to Battle.net servers and allow me to launch Modern Warfare Campaign Remastered. Okay, so here we are in Windows version 10 2004 safe mode. You notice that because how I log in normally is a pin option, this is available to me in safe mode. This is only available on the insider build of Windows version 10 2004. Now, if you're on 1909 or below, uh, this fix will not work as of right now unless you either make a local account with a local account that will allow you to get into the safe mode or you go ahead and try essentially getting another laptop or a desktop, transfer the files, and grab the players to a folder that the game needs to generate essentially. Okay, so now that once you're in safe mode, you're allowed to go into here. I have a shortcut for Modern Warfare Remastered, so I'm going to use this right now. Click it. Let Battle.net upload and update at this point because networking is in safe mode right now. So uh, we allowed it, essentially. Okay, download new files. We having started our sale battle on that. Please try again. Promise to restart our green computer. Okay. Okay. Let's try opening battle net then. Should work because networking is fine. 
click the play button here instead. Okay, I'm going to say no this time. And this should fix it because we're in safe mode. We're going to generate a new config file, and it does. Yep, that is, I can't believe this is the actual issues. You have to get into safe mode then. Okay, so it looks like, um, yeah, like I said, the players two folder that needs to be generated with the config files of this game can only be made in safe mode as of right now. Yeah, that's the menu system. Press enter. Accept, obviously. Let's probably change this later. Yep, that is Modern Warfare 2 campaign menu system. So I'm going to go ahead and go to options. Go over to graphics. I'm going to change some settings and re basically save my config file at this point. So I'm going to go ahead and click windowed. That's fine. Let the prompt for allowed access. Okay, I'll do window full screen with a max FOB, essentially. Okay, I'll hit save, or I will save it, exit the game. Okay, so you notice in the location of where you stalled the campaign remastered, especially in Battle.net, you'll notice that there's a Battle.net uh, place where you set the location. I have three games in here, Black Ops 4, Modern Warfare, and Modern Warfare 2 campaign. Open that one. You'll notice that there's a Player 2's folder here. This Player 2 folder, as it says, has been modified May 1st at the time of this video right now. And if you open it, you'll notice that there's a creation of a profile here. So that profile name 343934193. That is the profile of the game currently. As you notice, there's a config that has been edited. Now, in this config file, you'll notice that it says here, Call of Duty... For Call of Duty MW2R, do not modify. And you'll notice that there's a whole bunch of uh, hex code essentially made for these particular drivers and things. So now once I get into the main screen, once I go back to my normal screen, out of safe mode, this should work. And we're going to launch. So I'll see you on the desktop. Okay, so now we're back. We're back on the screen. We're back on my normal, on my normal uh, account, essentially. Out of safe mode, we're going to try the game again. So right now this will change because now there's a player twos folder inside of the game. So if we look back at the actual location of the installed files, we go back to my place, Battle.net, or two campaign. You notice that the player twos folder is now there with a generated time of May 1st, 2020. So I'm going to click play this time. Still running as admin for some reason, but it's fine. We don't worry about that. Don't worry about that. And yet, yeah, game works now. Okay, so essentially what is missing is the Players 2 folder. So that Player 2 folder needs to be generated, and as of right now, it is not being generated correctly in normal Windows mode. You have to go into safe mode, essentially, to generate said files. Safe mode with networking, to be exact. So I hope this uh, guide will help you out. If you have any other questions, let me know down below in the comment section. And, or if not, you can hit me at Twitter at Diamond Rice. I'll see you in the next one. Thanks for watching.